Good morning, good morning. Morning campers, I'm very excited. I'm just picking up my friend Zoe and we're on our way to Brighton. She's um so lovely because I was feeling down. She decided to book us a night in a hotel in Brighton so we can just go and have some girly time and it's got a spa so we can just relax. So yeah, she's so lovely. I'm a very lucky girl. So yeah, I'm just picking her up now. It's 10 o'clock Sunday morning um, and we're gonna head down. So I'll speak to you when we're there. Oh, also it's absolutely hissing it down. Now this is typical British summer weather. <laughs> So yes, you can probably see it. Uh, it's not great, but never mind. We're still going to have a fabulous time. So I'll speak to you when I'm there. We've arrived. It's very so It actually took forever, didn't it? Because there was traffic, so we had to reroute. So it took about how long? Two, two, about two, two, two and a half hours. hours. Zoe's here. She's hiding until she's got mascara on. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so we got to the hotel. Oh my god, walking to the hotel, we nearly got blown away. Literally. <laughs> Literally. We actually couldn't walk at one point. Um, so we decided to not venture back out and we went in the spa that's here, which is why I've got a little bun head. Um, and now we've just checked into our rooms because it's like three o'clock. So I thought I'd give you a quick room tour before we trash the place. <laughs> right. Okay, so I, I, the door is right behind me. So you come in, and there's a mirror, hey. Then there's a bathroom, very nice large shower, sink, robes and all that jazz. Then you come round here. Robes? Yeah, on the back of the door. There's a Zoe in the corner. A humongous bed, which you actually can't see on here, but it's really tall. It's very nice. Wardrobes. The bed. Oh, it's a bit swanky, that mirror. <laughs> mirror. Oh, we have got a side sea view. Oh, look at that. So, fancy. like, you can't see because it's been raining, but just out there is the sea. There she is. <laughs> and, and yeah, we've got gin and sherry. I wonder if this is free. It must be. I don't know. Should we smell it? Yeah. Might knock you out. Oh Jesus. <laughs> uh, strong it's cute though, isn't it? We don't know if this is free. We're trying to work that out for now. But yeah, that's our room. Love it. I will show the spa and everything tomorrow because we just like rushed in there today and we're gonna spend more time there tomorrow. So and it should be quieter. So I'll do a proper tour of the spa then. But yeah, we're gonna I don't know what we're doing now actually. Get out of these wet clothes, but I look like a pee myself. <laughs> oh, yeah, that. And then, oh, I need to quickly edit a thumbnail for tonight's video. And then are we going to go for a little wander? Are we going to yeah, brave the weather? Yeah. Then we're going to go for a wander. And then we'll probably come back and get ready for dinner and drinks tonight. Woo! <laughs> to go for dinner. Definitely thought it was a picture. And, oh yeah, sorry, I should have warned you. Um, and drinks, and see where the night takes us. And it's still pissing it down. Oh, has it stopped raining now? No. No, and it's very windy, so I didn't bother with false eyelashes because they would get blown off. We went for a little walk around the town, and that was it really, we didn't really get, oh, I tried a dum dum donut, but I'm gonna, I tried a mini, I'm gonna get bigger ones tomorrow to take home for everyone to try. And we went to the sea. We yeah, we walked along the sea. Oh yeah, I filmed a little bit. So you'd have seen that. It's very choppy. And we got a pret. Mm -hmm. I got a mocha. It was good. And so we got a hot chocolate. So yeah, we're gonna go and grab some food. I think we're feeling burgers, and then drinkies. 
so I don't know how much of this night you're gonna see because I'll probably get distracted by food and alcohol but you know <laughs> we'll give it a go. <laughs> yeah exactly I try my best Morning! We are up and alive. Barely. It's two minutes to nine and we're going to go down to the spa. So I'm going to show you what that looks like when we're down there. We had a good night last night, didn't we, Zoe? Yeah. <laughs> a little bit tipsy. <laughs> um, but we got back quite early so we're feeling kind of fresh this morning which is good so yeah I'll show you the spa when we get down there everybody it is now Wednesday I think I last spoke to you Monday morning when was it oh no the last thing you saw was when I was at the breakfast club in Brighton which was about midday Monday um after that food was delicious by the way um but after that we um got a message from oh that was really wonky sorry about that we got a message from one of our old school friends bryce and he actually lives in brighton so we met up with him for a coffee and then we ended up just spending the whole afternoon with him he showed us around north lanes because i've never been to that part of brighton before um then we wandered down to the beach and then we headed home at about half six i think it was and um, so i was home by about quarter past eight something like that no maybe we left a bit later than half six i think we left yeah it took about an hour 40 to get home anyway um and then i watched the love island final so yeah 
that was it. I didn't really vlog much else, to be honest, for the rest of that day because we've not seen Bryce in literally years. So, yeah, we just caught up with him and then came home. But had such a good weekend. Like I said, I'm so lucky to have such good friends and family around me at the moment. Like, loads of my friends have been amazing. Zoe, bless her, obviously took me away to Brighton to cheer me up. James gave me money so that I could actually go, so I could, like, buy food and stuff. Bless him. And my friend slash fairy god sister, um, Lucy, last week came around with chocolate and beautiful yellow happy flowers. And I'm actually sitting her tonight for a sleepover. Um, I've seen my friend Emma. I've had messages from loads of my family. So, yeah, I just wanted to sort of give you a little update and show to everyone that it's so worth speaking out and speaking to people about it because it, it just goes to show how many people love you and care about you and want you to know that they're there for you obviously my mum and nan have been amazing as well and my mum's best friend james has been really good so yeah i'm just very very fortunate to have such lovely family and friends so yeah i just wanted to like give you a little update the last week i've actually been feeling much better as well it was only last night i felt a little bit anxious for some reason but other than that i've actually been feeling a lot better so that's also good news and i've had really good news about my business loan that has been granted now which means i can get on with really pushing foil trilogy out there and I'm doing a trial day at Greenwich Market next week. And so just everything's looking up, which is nice. It's a relief. So, yeah, anyway, so I thought I'd just get back on here because I didn't get a chance to vlog yesterday just because I was really tired. So I laid in. Then I had, like, washing and sorting stuff out to do. I mean, it doesn't look like, a, well, I haven't tidied in here. It's a mess, actually, because... Um, I stayed at my nan's last night because it was Tuesday, so I go to hers on a Tuesday. So yeah, I've just, I've been busy, but I thought I would come back here because I'm just labelling up some of my jars. So I thought I'd show you um, what I've just done and then I'm going to show you the machine I used to do it because it's so cool. So this is my jar I've just done, one of my ombre ones. This isn't on my Etsy yet, but it will be. So you're getting a little sneak peek of a new product, but yeah. This is the yellow and white ombre and I've gone for gold font on this one and then I will have a gold lid as well. Um, but I'm just doing all the labels at the moment and then I'll do the lids after. So this is for the, like basically what it's going to look like finished obviously with the gold lid too. As promised I said I would show you what my finished products look like. I'm about to pop this label on just a plain white jar so I'm going to do that quickly but I'm going to set up the camera just so you can see what I do um, and then I've got more labels to create so you'll get to see that as well it's just more exciting getting you to getting to show you a few bits really so yeah I also completely forgot to mention the fact of my very extreme makeup for a uh, Wednesday <laughs> well I filmed this makeup look this morning so um that's why I've got it like this. And I did have false lashes on, but I pulled them off because they were getting on my nerves. Uh, yeah, so this will be hopefully up. This makeup look will hopefully be up by the time you see this anyway. But I thought I'd just address the fact that I have very extra makeup for a Wednesday afternoon. This bit's quite fiddly, by the way. <laughs> if you hadn't guessed. We're getting there. Nearly done. Ta-da! And that is another jar. And again, I just need to pop the gold lid on and then that's the finished product. So I have just done um, my labels on the Cricut Design Space. 
and I've worked out the size of the vinyl I need. Now I'm going to show you how this machine works because it's like the coolest thing ever. So I'm just sticking my vinyl on like this sticky mat that you get with it and then I'm going to turn this bad boy on. Right, I'm just loading my mat and material. And now I'm pressing go. And you get to see this little bad boy work. is as easy as that. I don't know if you can see the like cut out part in here now. I'm going to speed up everything else. You can see like what I'm doing as I go because otherwise it will take forever. Done, and you're getting another sneak peek of another new color so I'm really spoiling you today so my camera is about to die so I think I'm gonna wrap up the vlog here in my next vlog I'll probably show you like all of my jars when I'm done because I'm gonna be doing them over the next couple of days so by the time it's the weekend I'm gonna have loads of them done fingers crossed so thank you so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed this vlog I certainly did because I had an amazing time in Brighton um, and i've been nice and busy so yeah i hope you enjoyed it if you did i'd love it if you would smash the thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next one bye